Tony Johnson and Riley Hitchcock, the two best active tournament players in the world. They, fittingly, will square off week one Golden T-Mobile World Championship head-to-head -head qualifying. We are in the championship match. Hi, everybody. I'm Chad Shrump, and this is the back nine of Cape Haven, a very solid course to have our championship match on. We tee off with these two players. Here is Riley after the tee shot. He's on the fairway. He will hit a grabber into this green. Very nicely done, and that will yield a birdie for Riley. Here is Tony Johnson, whammy, the 2021 Golden Tee Mobile World Champion. Hits a good shot in with the orbit, almost holds it out, so good start for Whammy. No nerves from either player. We talked about this previously. Tony Johnson has never lost a World Championship qualifying match. He is undefeated. He is 5-0, trying to become 6-0 and move his way to the championship in Las Vegas in September. He would be joining Larry Foster. Larry, the first person named to the World Championship via the Golden Tee Mobile Tournament Edition. Won the contest earlier this week. Here is a shot in. That is an orbit, and that just skims past the hole. Great shot from Tony Johnson. He has been deadly twice so far with the orbit. Riley floats in a sniper. That should be great shot points. No, I am willing to bet that is six feet with no great shot points. Yes, indeed. Six foot no love for Mr. Hitchcock. Tilt nasty, whammy, tied. After two holes, we go to hole number 12. And Tony Johnson will try to get as much out of this drive as he can. Rolling, rolling, rolling. He has a favorable win. He will be able to reach in two. Now, Tilt Nasty will go with the Maniacs. Let's see if that gets as far as the Torpedo does. Takes a wicked hop to the left, but he is fine as well. We should yield two Eagles here. Here's a four-wood Maniacs. Just has to get past that Sand Trap, and it does. Onto the green nicely. That will be an Eagle for Riley. Let's see if Tony can get a little closer. Five-wood Maniacs. Line looks very nice. Bounces just over the hole to the right side and rolls away. So two eagles here on hole number 12 for Riley Hitchcock and Tony Johnson. Again, trying to punch their ticket to the Golden T-Mobile World Championship in Las Vegas, Nevada in September 2023. Par 3, javelin. This will break left hard. Not hard enough for Tony, though. That will stay a little bit right. Now, let's see if Tilt Nasty can get a little bit closer. Hits this 99%, takes a bit off. This is bouncing towards the hole. That will also miss to the right and a little bit deep. So two birdies on the cards for these two exceptional players. Of course, Riley Hitchcock got his spot here in the championship match by acing Bonnie Moore 18 against Brian Muxlow in the semifinal round. Here's the tee shot. Drivable par four. Whammy with his third orbit of this match. And now Tilt Nasty will also hit a orbit. This one is with a three wood. That line looks better. I think he might be just outside of the range of great shot points again. He is. Here's a 15-foot eagle putt for Whammy, money. Seven-foot eagle putt for Tilt Nasty, money. No great shot points for either player. We have a very, very close match. Here's the tee shot on the 15th hole. Looks like there's a bit of runway. Players could get a little aggressive if they wanted to here. Tilt will. He will go to the far side of this fairway, goes over the water. He will have a little bit of an easier shot, I would imagine, than Tony. Tony will try a six-wood javelin. Six-iron javelin, rather. This needs to bounce right. It will. I think we have our first great shot points of this match. How many? 9,800. So an early break, an early tie-break advantage for Tony Johnson. Whammy. 
If these players are tied after 18 holes, and by God, it looks like they might be, great shot points will decide the match. Here is the sniper from Tilt Nasty. That's more points. How many? 7,400. He was much closer. He got closer to the hole, but not quite as many great shot points. So Tony Johnson still has a touch of a lead on great shot points. About 2,000 more than Riley Hitchcock. Both players will birdie the 15th hole. We now go to the teeth of this course. 16, 17, 18. 16, of course, we need to land on the pier into a 12-mile-an-hour win. Tony will fire up a sniper, lands perfectly. He is fine. Riley will try a three-wood Maniacs. Just need to get up on this pier. The Maniacs bounces softly. The wind actually will slow that ball down. Now Tony will attack with a 320 driver grabber. Needs to get up. It doesn't. That will be either a Ranger putt or a chip for Tony Johnson. Riley Hitchcock, sniper into the green. Just short, but that's great shot points. He will take an advantage. He now has about a 14,000 GSP lead over Whammy. And once again, the tiebreaker, if these players are tied after 18, we will go to the cards, and it's all about the great shot points. Tony Johnson. He will have a ranger putt, a big one, and he makes it. A left six from the rough, dead center cup. Of course, Riley knocks in his easy putt. We are tied after 16 holes, moved to the par 3 17th. Last time Tony saw this, he watered against Russ Lyons. This time, he is fine. Plants that sand wedge sniper onto the green. Riley will try the same shot with a bronze tee, takes a touch off of it, and they both will have birdie putts. We are going to come down to the 18th hole. Riley Hitchcock, 14,000 GSP lead over Tony Johnson. This is one of the more difficult 18th holes Let's see how this one fares. Tony with a Maniacs needs points. Into the green. Bounces. Will it come back? Yes, it does. It is out of range of GSPs. Riley Hitchcock just needs to eagle this hole. 310 driver. Javelin. This will climb the green. That should be enough to do it. Tilt Nasty should punch his ticket. First, Tony Johnson with the putt. It is in. Riley Hitchcock to go to Vegas. He is in. Riley Hitchcock. Tilt nasty. 13 under a piece. Great shot point win. And he defeats Whammy. Gives Tony Johnson his first ever defeat in World Championship qualifying. What a match.